Country Shooter 98. We've got the STI 2011 DVC open gun back out for range day number two session. Uh, this thought it'd be a good time, beautiful day out here to get it out and have some fun. Um, give you a couple little updates on the gun. I'm not gonna go too in depth into the specs. We kind of did that in part one. Today we're just gonna shoot a little more, but I will run through a little bit of it. Um, you see, uh, you got the five inch bull barrel with a compensator. Um, you got the racker back here and it's ambidextrous. You can switch it to either side. Uh, come with the Seymour uh, rail and red dot system, oversized magwell, oversized mag catch. Um, got the double undercuts. Trigger's phenomenal, just like um, previous videos you see where I did uh, about the STI DVC three gun. Um, they advertise it two and a half pounds. I normally get somewhere between 1.6 and 1.9 pounds on my trigger scale. Um, got the tree bark stippling job I love. Ambidextrous safety. Just a beautiful gun, super smooth. Everything about it is just awesome. Uh, one thing I talked about some in the first review is I was having some problems with some of my ammunition going completely into batteries, kind of stopping like right here. Um, I called STI, they said it could have been an ammo problem, uh, make sure I was keeping it lubed. I was keeping it lubed everywhere I thought I needed to, you know, on the barrel hood, up front in the barrel, the slides back here. Um, I tried some different ammo, I was having the same problem with all the same ammo, reloads, my buddy just reloads, black dot ammunition. This is the same thing over and over again. Uh, it wasn't nothing major, this would happen about once a mag or so. Um, and I was talking to my buddy, that's a gunsmith, and he said, Try lubing your barrel link up really nice and, and get it really good and lubed up. I did that, I've never had a problem since. So that was just a simple, uh, something I overlooked. I wasn't oiling enough. I oiled it up real good, been running flawlessly ever since. So, and that's running my reloads, my buddy's reloads and the Black Dot Ammunition. Uh, big thanks to Black Dot Ammunition. They've helped me out in the past. Really good ammo, check them out. Um, other than that, uh, you know, I've just been uh, trying to break it in. One of the other things I do want to say I did put on it is I went to, uh, it's, uh, I got put a gas pedal on it. This is from, I think they're called, uh, let's see here, Go, Go Gas or something like that, Go Gas Pedal. But anyways, I put a gas pedal on it just because um, the way I gripped the gun, before my thumb kept landing on the Seymour mount here, the rail and it was just it would get uncomfortable after a couple mags it was kind of really with the vibration so this has made made it much more comfortable to shoot so with uh, anything else said let's have some fun uh 220 round mags and the big boy the 27 round mag is what it came with too in the mags so come with everything you need uh instructions how to sight the red dot and all that good stuff so let's just get some ears on and have some fun shoot this bad boy um, if you never shot a static red dot like this, you ever have a chance, you should. It's a ton of fun. I mean, you just don't get off target with it. It's awesome. Thank you to everybody who's been watching. Has subscribed. If you haven't already, please do. Hit the like button if you like the videos you're watching. Really appreciate the support. Uh, feel free to chat, comment, feedback, questions, whatever. I'll get right back with you. Let's do it. Never shot nine millimeter major too. Um, it's a different animal than just regular nine millimeter. It's kind of like going from a 38 special to a 357 magnum. Um, it's got a little more knockdown power, a little hotter. Uh, it's a fun. It's fun though. It's a lot of fun. Fun round. All these resetting targets and the tree and everything i mean it really it, it'll knock them down and reset them with some authority it's got quite a bit more pop than just your standard nine mil oh let's see finish the tree up real quick
part just folds that thing down. We'll shoot the reset rack back here real quick. quick when you're having fun. <laughs> Uh, before I forget real quick, let's uh We'll try a 50 yard gong here. We'll stretch her out a little bit Take out the Texas Star here. All right. You know, I haven't shot him in a while. This is probably the perfect gun to do it. Let's see what happens. Let's go bowling. I think it's probably a, I'd say strike, maybe spare. <laughs> oh, what to shoot, what to shoot. Let's go out to 25 yards, hit that cowboy. <laughs> hit that little plate there, 25 hanging. Man, what a lot of fun this gun, though, I'll tell you. That is the STI 2011 DVC open gun. I mean, if you're looking for a competition gun, race gun, steel challenge gun, this is it. I mean, beautiful gun. Uh, you just seen, ran all three mags flawlessly, no hangups, nothing, you know, the whole issue or not going to full battery, that's just all solved. Keep them lubed up. Make sure you lube up the barrel link as well. <laughs> Don't be a dummy like me and forget it. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.